Hey there, Shalko here. Strange times we're living in. I thought we could all benefit from finding a little inspiration inside. Let's go. Books. Every year, I curate photos from our adventures into a book for my sweetheart. Now is a great time to go through your photos from the last year, pick some of your favorites, and make a little keepsake for your loved ones. You can even have them mailed directly to them. Beautiful! Plants! My new favorite thing are these owl planters. Check them out. If you're like me, you already have everything at home you need to do some planting. If not, no worries, you can find it all online. Now's a great time to get lost in the garden, spruce up some potted plants, or dive into gardening for your first time. Home styling. This is a great opportunity to spruce up your space. Styling a space leaves me feeling inspired from the moment I set my eyes on it. Build a fort. Come on, when's the last time you built a fort? You know you want to. Completing projects. Now's a great time to complete a project you've been meaning to get to. Look at what I've been sitting on. <laughs> Much better. Upgrade your home office. If you're investing in the ergonomics, it's practically investing in yourself. Maybe upgrade your chair, hopefully something more ergonomic and less Victorian than mine. Dance, dance, dance break. Dance. Not getting as much cardio as you usually do? Great time for a 30 second dance break. <laughs> Post a Zoom dance party, FaceTime your friends and dance, just dance, dance. Inspiration jar. This is my inspiration jar. Every time I think of something that I can't do, someplace I can't go, I write it down on my inspiration list. Then I put it in the jar. Hopefully things will return to normal soon, and one day you'll get bored, or not know what to do with yourself, and you'll have a whole list of inspiring things to do. I made this book of places that I want to visit, and I keep it in my car. You may have seen it on some of my road trips and adventures. So when I have an opportunity to go on a trip, but I'm not sure where I should go, out comes the adventure book. Hey, why don't we check out those obsidian fields in Oregon? Well, I think we know why not today, but someday, soon. Finding beauty in everyday objects. This is a container of salt. There is an art to finding beauty in everyday objects. I like to kick my days off by taking an everyday object and putting it in the studio. It gets things going while removing any roadblocks to creating. There's an abundance of materials literally everywhere and you can't mess it up. I hope it left you inspired. If so, go ahead and hit that like button. If you know somebody who could use some inspiration, feel free to share this video with them. Wishing you all the best in these challenging times. I'm Shalako. This is Finding Inspiration Inside. Tons of great content coming, so go ahead and subscribe if you'd like notifications for future videos. 
I will see you in the next one. Dun 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 dun